All right, on your right, Mike Hughes. On your left, Shaquem Griffin. Go ahead. Shaquem, I think that was your first career, college career touchdown. Uh, just walk us through that moment and tell us about that. Um, well, to be honest, I ain't know I had the ball until I got in the end zone and everybody started screaming. And my whole thing was I seen the ball, I was like, I might just miss this, but if I do, I just jump on it. And then the ball just taken to my glove, he's like, no, just keep running. <laughs> and it's crazy because, like, the excitement that I have to, to score a touchdown for the first time, it's, it's amazing. And to be honest, I came and put it in words. It's just, I was just so happy just to do it in front of the, the student session. I was just going crazy. I remember, I remember Tony Garage like, why would you run it so far? I said, I didn't know what to do with my legs at that point, so I just kept going. You know, it, it was exciting, and, I, you know, I, I love every moment of that. Is that your first ever touchdown? You had one in high school? Or? No, never. First, first touchdown ever. Wow. <laughs> you say you didn't realize you had the ball uh, when you crossed the you know invisible track tape at the goal line. Was that just like natural instinct, or was that you know I, my my inner AK came out? <laughs> so you know once I kept running, I was like, no, I'm gonna dip at the line, and you know maybe AK was like, you know we can race one day. <laughs> When you see some of these other teammates, you get to see defensive linemen scoring and stuff. I mean, would you always think in the back of your mind, man, I'd like to get one of these and, and put in six? Oh, yeah, always. It's, it's always like that. You just got to wait for your opportunity. And when I had my chance, you know, I, was, I went all out for it. Mike, you had that huge return, and then it looked like, you know, you went down and out there for a couple of plays. How important was it for you to get back out there, even in a game uh, like this against an FCS Uh I mean, it's very important, uh, you know, just to – let the guys know I'm okay. Uh, you know, just try to get back, got, get back out there, and play with my brothers, and uh, you know, just give everything I got, man. That's what I did. What do you think it shows that you had that kind of effort to, to run that guy down? What does that show to your teammates? Uh, you know, just like I said, just having each other's back, holding each other accountable. Um, I saw the play on the other side break, and you know, I just tried to chase it down, and I got there. What was the mood uh, after the game? It sounded like the coaches, I mean, you got the win, it was program high scoring, but there were some things that they didn't seem very happy about. What was the mood for the team? Oh, yeah, we, we came out kind of slow, and, um, you know, we, we preached all week about uh, playing at a certain standard, and uh, I don't think we met those standards today. So I think he was uh, a little disappointed, but, you know, a win is a win, and uh, we, we, we're still going to celebrate it. So. Shaquem, uh, coach talked about tackling. He said the first drill you guys are going to do Monday is the tackling drill. Uh, what happened there in the, in the first quarter, especially? It seemed like you guys just want to tackle. I mean, our, our whole thing is just like uh, Mike was saying, we, we just got to do better at, at what we've been taught. You know, I, I think that we got beside ourselves in the beginning of the first quarter. And, you know, we had to bounce back from that. And, you know, I think it's good that come Monday, you know, we can slow it down, get back to the basics, and, and kind of just go every, go over everything. You know, we're, we're getting deep in the season, and sometimes it's important to go back to the basics, and I think that's going to be good for our team and our defense to kind of go over that. And I feel like, you know, I'm glad it happened now and later, and we're going to bounce back from, you know, today. This is the second week in a row that Dredrick Snelson made some kind of amazing catch. Uh, what are your thoughts on him and his play? Uh, we go against him every day, so uh, we 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 see that every day. Um, it wasn't really surprising, but that catch was pretty amazing. I I give him that. Hopefully, he's on top ten. <laughs> <laughs> Anything else for these guys? What did you guys see on that, that targeting call, and how tough can it be to maybe pull up or not give that little extra bit of effort sometimes? I mean, on a targeting call like that, it's. It's so hard, and you know they're so strict when it comes to targeting. It's there's not much you can do, and sometimes you can try to defend yourself, but there's not much you can do. You know, uh, Kyle Gibson came up on the hit, and you know sometimes sometimes they they get you with it, and you know we don't shame nobody for what's being done, and you know obviously it's that was a tough call, and yeah, I guess the refs had to, it had to make it, and you know we we're gonna have him back soon, and you know he's gonna be ready to play. You know, Coach Frost said he let emotions kind of get to him, but but what's it like when you see him sticking up for you guys? You see Coach Frost getting animated. He got a flag too. I mean, when it comes to Coach Frost and sticking up for us, it just shows that. And I say it before every game. You know, this is more than just a team. You know, it's a family, and you know, Coach Frost always gonna look out for our backs and stuff. And no matter the situation, no matter what the call is, you know, uh, obviously he taught us that, uh, that today after the game about keeping your composure. But you know, sometimes you get in the heat in the morning about somebody getting in your family. You know, that, that's just your initial initial action is just, you know, I'm gonna protect my boys no matter what. Did that feel like a very weird, strange, emotional game? The first half, two unsportsmanlike calls. Um, you know, there was a scare with you. You got your first career touchdown. Just a lot going on in that first half. Yeah, I mean, it's a lot going on, but we all know we, we got to stay level-headed in this league. Um, like Coach always says, it's hard to win football games in this league, you know. Like we, we just got to keep our composure, you know, keep playing. Uh, somebody goes down, next man up. So I think that's what it is.
think we'll be pretty good. We're good? All right, guys. Thank Appreciate you. Guys. Thanks, guys. Appreciate Appreciate you.